Are you tired of looking at those dusty vision boards that never came to pass that you worked so hard on? Or looking at those journals that just poured your heart out but never brought you what you want? Well, I understand why you have failed and I wanna help you change that today because this is principle number three of creating your heart's desire. Imagine your dream. Now there are nine principles to creating what you want and I'll tell you more about that later, but today we're gonna to work on principle number three. Do you know most people don't succeed because your imagination, which is essential for creating your heart's desire, has been either hijacked or toned down or actually robbed altogether so you don't really have access to the power of your imagination? Well, we're gonna create a change for that today. Imagination is the out picturing, the internal picturing of what you want to come back to you in the world. Look around you, every single thing that's in your life, someone imagined, someone imagined this, this camera I'm talking to, someone imagined the lights in the room, someone imagined the clothes you're wearing. Imagination is the essence of manifesting your dream. So here's a special tip I'm gonna teach you and stay with me until the end because I have exciting news to share when we're done. So here's the tip. Decide what it is you want. Focus, that's the key. What would you like to create? And not ultimately, just right now. Bring that to your mind. Can you see it? Can you imagine it? Take two fingers in your left hand and I want you to place them above, just about parallel to your eyebrows and above. And there's a spot there that I want you to tap. This is called your sixth chakra. This is your imagination screen. So I want you to tap it because it'll wake it up. Take your right hand and place it at the back of your head and you're gonna feel a little indentation right there. This is a secret chakra that I've never talked before, about before. This is called your moon chakra. This is your feel good center and it amplifies the sixth chakra that helps you visualize. So it creates sort of a, an arrow from the back of your head through your forehead and out. Now. Call to mind what it is you want in as much detail as you can possibly imagine while gently tapping this sixth chakra. Now gently, you don't have to knock yourself out. Gently tap this, take your other hand, and while you're doing that, run this in a circular motion. So you tap and then you rub in a circular motion and breathe. Ah, this releases a flood of light and good energy, even the chakra itself is white. It floods your body with light, it floods your emotional body with healing vibration, so you remove your obstacles like doubt and frustration and depression and anger. So it clears the path, which is part of principle number four, eliminate your obstacles. You're doing two things at once. Gently tap, then circular motion and breathe and imagine your dream like you're looking at this movie on the biggest silver screen you ever saw. Even if you take glimpses of the movie, like there I am getting a warm hug from my beloved, or there I am signing the contract and shaking hands with someone or seeing people lined up for my business or, or dancing and feeling as exuberant and full of life force as possible. Whatever your dream is, imagine snippets. It's hard to see the whole movie, but each time you do this, breathe and like you're looking on a screen, just imagine another snippet of this beautiful experience. And this is gonna amplify and activate. So you're using principle number three, imagine your dream, which is what these two connected energies, the sixth chakra and your secret chakra, and principle number four, eliminate your obstacles because this chakra releases a flood of healing nectar in your body that lifts up your spirit clears depression, calms your nervousness, calms your doubting mind, removes the, the, the old energy that's stuck and preventing you from bringing in a new experience. You do it a couple seconds, as often as you want, but instead of fretting and worrying and thinking it can't happen, just tap, circular motion, breathe, and then release, ah and smile because that opens the heart chakra. So you're connecting the heart, 
to the sacred chakra, to the third eye, and you're creating this beautiful wave of positive energy that floods you and you're projecting it onto a screen where you see what you really want happening. But like I said, it's not easy, especially if our, if our intuition has been hijacked, to imagine the whole thing. We don't have the attention span. We don't have the bandwidth. So just snippets. And each time you do this, think of a new snippet. So for example, say you were a lonely person and you want to create a real partner. So you're gonna breathe, tap, rub, you're kind of setting the machine in motion. Ah, and as you rub, you see the energy going here, lighting up the screen, and you see a, a scene. We're walking hand in hand. We're walking along the beach or we're riding bikes together or we're in the kitchen making dinner together or we're making love together. We're laughing, we're having fun, whatever it is, but just focus on that snippet. That's how you imagine your dream. Just that snippet. And if there's any negative doubting energy, principle number four is relieve your, you know, remove your obstacles. As you Release this secret chakra at the back of your neck. See it releasing a golden nectar, which it does, that, that floods your body with calming energy. You can even put your hand at the back like this and just roll your hands back and breathe. Ah. Then you release that sigh. Ah. Drop into your heart and smile. So you do this because it's sh shifting and changing and informing your body on how to do something different. There are nine principles, but this is really the importance of principle number three is we cannot create what we cannot imagine. And we can't imagine things in huge, long episodes because just like imagination, it works with, with meditation. Take some training, but snippets are enough. Just have fun with well, what's the next little snippet. Like for example, if you wanna create a new job, maybe the next snippet is you tap, then you rub in a circular motion gently. Ah, and you drop your hands, you imagine getting your first paycheck and thinking, wow, that felt great. Or, or seeing your first contract and it's bigger than you ever thought and the exhilaration that you're feeling. Maybe the snippet is you just see stamp paid, paid, paid on your bills. Or maybe you have a, a little snippet that you're with other people brainstorming and coming up with these great ideas. This is how to imagine your dream. In snippets, activating here from the back of your head, shooting it up like a movie screen, lighting up. And imagine, you can even imagine you're sitting in the movies with your popcorn and you're just watching these beautiful scenes unfold, but feel the euphoria flood through your body. That's the most important thing. Feel the joy, the satisfaction, ah, the reward. So I told you, if you stayed with me, I am going to be offering a way to teach all nine principles. This is three and four, but we actually need to focus and incorporate all nine principles in order to succeed in creating your heart's desire every time. Now, the good news is each principle is as easy as three and four that I just taught you. But unless you know them and you know how to implement them step by step, you're not gonna be successful in creating your heart's desire. You're just gonna be frustrated. That's why I'm now offering for the next five days a huge discount in my course, Creating Your Heart's Desire, how to actually manifest with ease and flow. And in it, I'll teach you how to work with your angels and guides, how to do each step easily and consecutively because it's natural, and how to do it with the help of the universe and your intuition and leave the past behind. I really wanna help you succeed. And the way to do it is to learn these nine principles just the way I was taught. I have so many successes. My clients write every week and tell me the impossible thing, that relationship, that job, the recovery of my health, the trip around the world, the brand new house I wanted, the ability to make a community that works. Week after week after week, I have been teaching this for over 50 years and I'm really good at it. Every year I've learned more things like the tips and tools I just taught you now. 
So don't wait, give yourself the chance to join me at a huge discount and learn how to create this because you'll have the tools for life. You can watch it over and over and over again and you get better and better and better until you become an expert. So please join me. You'll get all the information by clicking the link below, but it's only for the next five days. So don't get left behind. Learn these tools and empower your life and bring back the joy and the energy you deserve. I'll see you there. All my love.